this ends up being a, a pretty stable for Team 1. It's just a lot of strong champions sort of thrown together. Very, very akin to AP Keys. Yes, you're on a non-cannon so. wave. Flawless is going to go in there. One on one, that will soon turn into a one on two, but Kana taking huge damage. Ixu is going to get first blood, and Cuz does not have the damage. Red buff is going to go the way to Flawless again. They're oh. going to spot him the flash on in. Cuz doesn't have his flash. Goes for oh. the body slam, and Flawless is not going to die. Oh. Has the triumph, and it will be denied by Ixu. Able to save his life there. Now the one on one, and take a look at the position of Kaney. He's gonna find Faker first. Faker looking for that, but it's gonna be dodged. It totally misses. The Everything's Trishop going wide. Goes. It's really not pushing that fast. I can't tell. Nice hook coming in here, though. The stun is gonna go down, and Equalizer does just about zero. Actually, I think that T1's even favored. Could happen. They get the double knockup into the Equalizer. The cask as well for the burst. Kana is just going for the assassination attempt, and it's gonna work out, it's flawless. Has the stopwatch, really nice item, but take a look at the Aatrox, he's full health here, trying to dunk him down, but again, the stopwatch is going to be able to stop it here, and everybody on the side of APK is going way too low. Good scatter the weak, but it will not save your life, even that stopwatch. Oh, uh, yeah, there you go. Gonna go over to Teddy as T1, they get the engage. And the next Infernal Dragon is up, and remember, Speaking T1. Of which, oh, he's been oh, able to man. isolate Secret here. He's totally fine. Lands that, and he kills him all alone. Teddy just taking out one member by himself. Syndra trying to do that to him, but it's not gonna work out. T1 have been able to turn this game around. They're gonna shut down oh, three God. members. <laughs> On Speaking of a cursed tale. How about one on five? <laughs> Baker's trying to run. She actually healed. <laughs> one sticking around as, oh boy. That's a huge equalizer ticking for so much on Secret and Katie. That might just be the push they needed to take out another turret here. As she well won. As what? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's Camille for you, I suppose. Okay, Teddy ends up getting hit, but I think they're just gonna keep going. <laughs> I can't believe he died that fast. Okay. Well, they're gonna attempt to put up a resistance here, but they will be done. Everybody is just styling on them now. Faker's not gonna die. And that is gonna be the end of the game. They don't waste any time with that one. 31 and a half minutes, they're gonna take out Hybrid right before the end. GG. By a copy. <laughs> oh, by a copy. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately after he picked up a Morello. <laughs> oh no. He bought in, man. Kaney bought in. <laughs> <laughs> it was the long con. <laughs> yeah. Did that happen then exactly 20, 26 minutes there on the graph? Leaner than the scaling on the side of the APK. Is really gonna be on Kaney here to not fall behind in pressure and tempo to Faker in mid. Because if he did, if he does, pro play, they would think, oh, this guy misleveled up an ability yeah. or something. Oh, but, the oh, fly man. took. <laughs> Secret is gonna have the blast going here though. And he does get away. Nice outplay potential. Yeah. It's a little thing, but it can make the difference. Uh, Baker's just gonna face check and die. Baker. He's just getting in there. He's gonna miss his ultimate. Now he's in a really awkward spot. That should be a dead poppy. Pulling in the Blitzcrank, but Stopwatch, a great item. Doesn't have the flash, but he is gonna go down. Because spot as one-on-one -on -one up in the top side, Kaney gonna try to throw out that ultimate to deter Faker from coming in, and oh boy. He's in a bit of trouble here. The flash is available. There it is, oh. and it is predicted by Cuz. That's that another option. Didn't yeah. even consider that. We are diving on the back line. Hybrid is so screwed. As, uh, yeah, he's waving goodbye to his poor teammates that are left without him. That's a double kill now for Teddy. As Baker is running way into that back line, avoiding the knockup up until oh. now, and then he dies. As huh? they have a really nice amount of burst damage. Flawless. Recall group for the Mountain Dragon. It's so important for them to get it. Flawless, Flawless. he's got his ultimate. He's looking for it. Oh, man. And, uh, well, see you later. I don't know why he didn't just take it on draw. Oh, okay, stopwatch. Yeah. 
but in that case, you shouldn't have gone for it in the beginning. Teddy in a little bit of an awkward position, has a little alcove there because of the Mountain Soul. Ultimate comes out, decent scatter the weak, but not really going to land. Faker sidestepping Hybrid, who has not been too safe in this one. K is no. taking a little bit of damage. T1 is heavily favored in this, although Teddy, no mana. Oh, the outplay by Effort reads the hook and then gets in there and grabs, but it's just a kill. Effort, <laughs> um, hello? <laughs> And Renekton. <laughs> Strange way they funnel. Okay, we're just going and trying to kill Teddy now. He's going to flash away, but in goes the knockup, as does the Rek'Sai. The hook will not help him out here as Cast will sail wide. Kana with the TP is going to end up TPing into his death. That's definitely a bit of a mix up here for T1. Not what you were looking for, the hook into the death. This game is not over by a mile yet. Effort. Oh, okay, we're going into the K-Ram. Dead Sentence is going to land the first damage on Akana. Isn't enough. The stopwatch is better. As the Tainted Corruption is doing so much in that back line, and Baker has got to get out of there as the damage win will go the way of APK. Idiot USS. Oh, they got Cuz. Cuz is out of the fight. If they can burst it down, this would be Mountain Soul, and it's going to go the way of Forest. They picked it up. As Mountain Soul will go the way of APK, Kana is going to stay alive, oh, just barely. They are getting going. so many free stats right now. Now, it is a five on four around the Baron. Yeah, this is scary. APK could actually throw here. But effort is pretty low. They're trying to come in as four, as Baker what? is attempting an assassination. Oh, they got, they got the hook onto Kaney. That's what he needed. As the 5v4 should go the way of T1, but Hybrid is going to get flashed on. Down he does go, and Ixu should meet the same fate eventually. So they say, if we can burst him fast enough, maybe we can oh, do this. They're going to find Flawless, they, though, and yeah, he's, they a, got flawless. Yeah, he's a dead little void monster. Yep. Look at this. He's waiting. He's like, oh, oh, yeah. You can't dodge anymore as you're slowed and you're dead. Looks like it went through him. Either way. With the Baron in minute oh. 43, and they're oh. gonna find this guy. Just plops down the cask on his Tell face. Him to take a drink. Yeah, drink this. And down he will go. Nixu trying desperately, but he'll be flashed upon as yep. well. Cause his AP is greater than oh. the <laughs> the amount of resistances that the Poppy has. Another hook comes in as effort is just bopping him this this day on the Blitzcrank, and down will go the Nexus. The 2-0 comes through for the side of T1. Taking a look at the damage chart here. Teddy dealing quite a lot, and Cuz coming in second place on his team, respectively. Kenny trying to do what he could this game on the Syndra. Played it both games tonight. It's nice seeing Syndra pop up more in the LCK.